Thank you for choosing Arby's. I'm sorry about that. What can I get for you today, huh? Um, you had, you had, you had you had right? Hey, Pollywogs. Hey. We're trying Arby's today. The new King Hawaiian brown sugar bacon BLT and turkey. So, I'm having the turkey. And I'm having the BLT. Also, got some fried cheesy bites. And some jalapeno bites. And then, the new mint chocolate shake. Take a look at that. Mmm. Mm. Let's see what that's like. So, so, stay tuned and see how it goes. All right. We're gonna start with the BLT. So we got the Hawaiian King Bun. I'm gonna open it up. Mm, sugar bacon. Bacon. Mm -hmm. Ooh, is that brown sugar I see attached to it? Mm -hmm. I see some mayo. Mm -hmm. Lettuce. I see some lettuce. I don't see a tomato. Uh oh. Is it under there? Mm. No, there's no tomato. No what? tomato. How do you not put a tomato on a BLT? So this will be a BL. <laughs> Where got us a BL? And these are the jalapeno poppers with the bronco berry sauce. Well, that's going to be a slightly disappointing. Hmm. I wonder if mine looks that way. All right. And so next to that, we're going to lay out the turkey. So we got the King's Hawaiian. I'll lift it up. Bacon. Sauce. We got the turkey. And I guess on the bottom. Let me see about flipping this bad boy over. Bloop. Bloop. Oh, yeah. We got tomato. Hey, I got two of them. You want me to put one on yours? Sure. All right. So we're going to. I didn't see no tomato on his. I'm going to flip it over just to be on the safe side. Nope. No tomato. So I'm going to make Alfred's sandwich a little bit better. I'm going to give him my tomato. Now he's got a true BLT. Hmm? So we'll see. All right. And stop. Okay, now. All right, I'm going to start with a cheesy bite. Let's see what this, uh, the mac and cheese. Oh. Oh, oh, it looks so gooey. Mm. <laughs> Ready? Cheese pool. Mm. 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 It's cheesy. You see inside of it? Nope, mm -hmm. oh, I see the noodle. Mm. Gooey and crunchy, gooey and crunchy and cheesy. Mm. I kind of like that one. Mm. Have to get another one. See if it's consistent. One more. Ready? Mm. Tastes like mac and cheese. All right, okay. your turn. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I taste the macaroni and cheesy. That's pretty good. It's crispy. 
Mmm. Mmm, really good. I like my macaroni and cheese like that. <laughs> mm. Maybe I a new guess. recipe to try at home? Crunchy, yes. cheesy macaroni? Yes. Mm. Now, we know they've been around for a while. But it's a jalapeno popper with a little bit of the bronco berry. Mm -hmm. They're hot the last time I tried them. Mm. Mm. Did you pull the whole pepper out? Oh, yep. It's empty <laughs> cavity. So it's the jalapeno, cream cheese, little bronco berry. Good flavor. Very good. But it's not hot, like spicy. No. Yeah, I can tolerate these bad boys. They're so good. Mm-mm, slap full of cream cheese. Yep. <laughs> oh, I see the cream cheese falling out. Mm. Mm. Good stuff. In case you want to see what the inside looks like. Mm -hmm. See that cream cheese and that jalapeno pepper? Mmm, good stuff. Mm. All right, now it's BLT time. And brown chicken. See what that bacon tastes like. Oh, his eyes got big. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, wow. That's a kick in it. It's very, very sweet. Is the bread sweet? The bread is sweet. The bacon is sweet. Then the nice crunch of the bacon, crispy. Oh, that is so good. It's so good. Mm. Take another bite. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm not a fan of these stringy lettuce. I wish they would have had a beefy lettuce. But that's good. Okay. Mm. I see there's some bacon down there in the bottom. Mm -hmm. What does it taste like by itself? Just that little piece of bacon. Mm -hmm. Can you see any sugar on it? It is a crispy bacon with glaze on it. Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna pick up this bad boy. Mmm, it's a pretty nice size sandwich here. Mm -hmm. So this one is the one that has turkey in it. Check mm. mm. wow. that out. Sweet. really good with that turkey. It is sweet. It's got a little, um, it's got deli mustard on it. So it gives it also a little bit of that pepper bite. Mm. Focus. Okay. Yeah, it looks good. Mm -hmm.
Mint chocolate. Mm. Would you like to try this? I sure will. That way you can be a judge too. Oh wow. Do you even like mint chocolate? My dad, that's good. Mm. Mm. All right. We're going to finish everything up here. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to be back to tell you what we think. Yeah, and what I think. I said we. No. We ain't got time. I might have to leave this one in. Oh! Ready? Ready. All right, we had to come back briefly because it's the last bite. Time to savor it. Savor the flavor. Mmm. After the last bite, we gotta cleanse the palate. Some Diet, Diet Coke. Coke. Now today, I got the shake. So Alfred, Anna. You so can. I guess this means today, I get to finish his. <laughs> no way. No way. I finish it. Mm -hmm. All right. So the brown sugar, bacon, lettuce, and tomato sandwich with the Hawaiian bun was really good. I really liked the bacon. It had plenty of taste and flavor in it. The sugar, you can taste it. You can taste the bun. It was fresh. Um, then you have the lettuce. You have the... I didn't taste the tomato as much but it was it's all com combination with the sandwich it made it taste really good and um overall i liked it yeah and of course i had the hawaiian brown sugar bacon turkey gosh that's a mouthful trying to remember all of that and uh mine was really good very sweet the king's hawaiian with the bacon went really good with the turkey and uh, really kind of gave the turkey flavor because you know turkey can be kind of bland if it's not seasoned well and uh, then it had the deli mustard which gave it a little bit of that bite or that peppery kind of I was digging it I thought it was actually really good mm -hmm. it was really good they also have another one it was, it's a uh, um, roast beef instead yeah. of instead of turkey yeah so we didn't try that one but if you would like that go ahead and try that one yeah so and let us know what you think of it so definitely on the dundee scale this is probably going to get really good points <laughs> so we also had the fried mac and cheese crispy gooey yeah great mac and cheese flavor i really enjoyed it then you had the the jalapeno bites they were also great too. They want on the they want on the hot level, uh, spicy hot. They want they want. So if you don't like spicy foods that much, you, you would like these. They were really good. Um, that, just be careful. Let them cool down because they are temperature hot, and so you gotta let them cool down because otherwise you have a mouthful of hot jalapeno, <laughs> <laughs> and I mean temperature. Yeah. So. Yeah. Burn that tongue. In yeah. A different has, kind of way. It has cream cheese in it, so that was good. So overall, I did like those too. And then we did the mint chocolate shake. Oh, that that was good. Which was really good. Um, I love mint chocolate, so for me, it was fantastic. Um, 
I don't like mint chocolate, but when I tried this one, it was really good. I don't think I tasted the mint, but uh, that's just me. But it was really good. So, all together on the Dundee scale, I'm totally going to give the brown sugar bacon turkey a 4.5. Um, I would, I would recommend going and trying it, right? Um, it was really good. Uh, it did get a little soggy there with everything. I guess the, with the mayo, the mustard, the turkey, it had a little bit of a, a sogginess to it if it set for a little bit. It was super sweet. So if you like some sweet meat, this is definitely in your ballpark. Um, really thoroughly enjoyed it. The mac and cheese bites, man. No crispy. I like they those. were crispy. I might have to give those bad boys a five because they were delicious. Yeah. Gooey, crispy, cheesy. It was it was awesome. Yeah, it makes me want to go out and get a box of macaroni and cheese and try to see if I can make them. <laughs> yeah. And the mint chocolate chip, I'm probably going to give that a 4.5 as well. It was really good. Um, they did let it sit. The line was kind of long for a little bit, so it got kind of... A little melted runny it wasn't a thick shake but uh overall it's pretty good i recommend you guys trying it now what do you think of yours well the bacon sugar uh, blt was delicious um i would have to give that one a five out of five if they remember to put the tomato yes on. <laughs> yes I, they, they did not put tomato on mine i had to share with april so yes and then the jalapeno bites were awesome, so I give that a five. Yeah, I love those, especially that bronco berry sauce. Mm -hmm. It makes it almost like having a dessert, that berry flavor with that cream cheese. And you gotta let us know what's, what sauce you would like it with that um, jalapeno bites or the cheesy bites. Ooh, they didn't have any kind of sauce for the cheesy bites, did well, they? No, but you you can get whatever you want from. I bet you yeah. they'd be good dipped in a little bit of ranch. Yeah, maybe. Mm, maybe good yeah. stuff. So if you like this, of course, remember give us a like. You can subscribe so you can see some more, and you can always support, right? Yeah. So buy us a cup of coffee. I'm a Dunkin' girl myself, <laughs> and uh, yeah, we'll see you guys on our next adventure. And re and remember, let us know what drink you would like with your meal.